Yes, so it's not always good to go in shooting. That's what I'm trying to say. You read me so well, Ginger. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so... Yeah. Okay. Um, I, I, mm -hmm. I didn't uh, see any obvious, you know, mm. people, you know, in, in tied up, tied up and brutalized or anything like that. Right. Let, let me, uh, let me, let me add this one bit though. Slaying enemies of the shadow, like orcs and goblins, is not the same slaughtering men who might or might not be evil. Exactly. His orcs are evil. Yeah, the, the orcs are generally thought of as evil, but still, slaying uh, uh, even an evil opponent that has lost its weapon or put down its weapon and oh, is yeah. no longer yeah, really a threat, that's a problem. So, yeah, yeah, if they surrender or give up or run away, yeah, that's that's another matter. Yeah. yeah. So, I'm, with a force of arms and some persuasion, negotiation, intimidation, we might be able to just get the sickle back without a fight. You might. But. Because. Mm -hmm. well, and, you know, if we have to fight, we have to fight. But. But. Between having a dwarf and elf and several capable humans, uh -huh. wood, woodmen or Peorian, you know, we're gonna, we're gonna intimidate most lesser men for sure. Yeah. Okay, so having said that, um, I'm going to say all of you get across the bridge. Okay, so you could move up into, say, this area right here. Okay. Um, and... What area are you referring to? Uh, you're not seeing my, um... I oh, see. Oh, I see. Now that I, now that I go down a little further. Okay. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna have to remove the walls because you're not supposed to be able to see, um, uh, any bad guys or anything back there. Uh, do you guys see bad guys? I see yeah. Right here. Okay. I was just believe they weren't there if you wanted me to. Yeah. I, <laughs> well, no, 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 no. As uh, that was supposed to be until you guys got to about here. I. It just doesn't make any sense to leave you guys sitting on the bridge. But it, you know, you can get behind uh, that area and stuff. You see them. They see you. Um, they do rise, and you hear two arms, two arms. But. But they don't charge you. Oh, what am I doing? I'm not trying to draw walls, Paul. I just hold my manic ready if needed. Okay. Let me get back here. I'm not trying to draw walls anymore because I failed at that. <laughs> <laughs> they do kind of spread out a little bit. Somebody uh, should get on the other side of me that has a bell or a sword. Okay, so they spread out like that, and, and they see you, and they do not recognize you as one of their own. You guys can go ahead and move up, uh, Luthwin yeah. and Ewald. Okay, that's all right. Okay, and um, uh, let's see, which one would it be? I this wanna, one. I want to just say, return the sickle, and you can keep your lives. Um, this one right here says, "Well, as you're as you're starting to to say that, return the sickle and you'll keep your lives." Um, this one says, uh, uh, "What do you want?" and is obviously interrupted by what you say, and then says afterwards, "What sickle?" Um, Where is uh, Senwin, the Cedric? <laughs> You have the hardest time with names. <laughs> I do. I'm sorry. No, no worries. No worries. Um, so you you basically speak up the the quiet one and say, um, "Where is Senric the archer? Are you trying to in, uh, actually Noreen? Are you trying to intimidate?" Um, I mean, 
you're you're kind of i'll just say this if you're gonna do interaction attacks like that uh i'm i'm gonna i'm gonna say you're probably too far away to effectively intimidate unless you tell me something that is out of this world and can can effectively intimidate from that point well i mean i'm i'm a dwarf in heavy armor who's carrying a magic with orange blood on it so i'm not really so you didn't clean um, off your blade the the, the magic Mm -hmm. um, yeah, I probably did. Yeah, I, I was just, I was gonna say but, you know that orc blood is black and it's it's got yeah. high acid content. Yeah, but uh, I mean that's fine. They don't have to listen to me. And uh, they don't seem to be terribly phased because you are distant, and uh, unless you're yeah, taking a run yeah. down the stairs, you're not really doing anything. Well, I'm. I was hoping they'd have their leader come out and talk to me, but whatever. What's funny is are they, you are they see responding about the archer. Are they what? Are they responding about the archer that we need? Uh, well, hold on a second, and let me let me describe something. And let's see, it's going to be you, old Radigund, and Norin. This one right here is standing in front of an exit from a hut and spread out from the fire here to get there. It's only a few meters, but still. So um, as for responding about uh, about Senric, uh, we know no Senric. Anybody want to try and detect if she's lying or he's lying? Yeah, uh, look mm -hmm. around. Uh, what do you mean, look around? No, I can see all of that. I'm trying to peer down into this little one that's enclosed in a fence. Oh, that one? Well, yeah. Okay, you see pigs that are wandering around there now. Three pigs. Uh, Yule, what were you saying? I was going to say, if anyone's really good at insight, this should be the best time to try and see if they're lying or telling the exactly. truth. Exactly. Exactly. I'm not great at insight, so someone else would have to probably give it a try. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, I only have one right here. I have two ticks in insight. Okay, but you're way back on the bridge. You're really... Yep. You, you've got running water all around you that is really noisy, so you don't really hear what's going on. Uh, no sound, anyone... sound escapes my hearing. Uh, is anyone nearby at least favored, maybe? Or at least has two or three? Is anybody's what? Is it favored for anybody if they're inside? Or they, oh, inside. Um, I, I don't know. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Let me back up a little bit. I, I got to go around the table here. Um, Duota, you don't really see much from where you're at. Uh, you see more or less the faces of uh, of these three these two and there so these three right here that's where you're gesturing hold on oh sorry the map is zoomed at the kind of angle where like i you, can only see like um, where we are you so can I'm use your in. you can use your mouse wheel to scroll out okay there we go okay so you've got Oh, hold on that. I need to hit shift and then that. Okay, you've got these two and this one that are uh, that you can see. <clears throat> what would you like to do? Um, hmm. Uh, I think maybe I could try to, like, try to diffuse the situation a little, try to talk to them. Well, okay, you've, like... you've got Noreen and Radigund who have already spoken uh, in demand. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Do you want to try and undermine your friends uh, in that way? Because that, in and of itself, could be a shadow point depending on how you do it. 
Uh, ooh, uh, ooh. That's a thinker. Okay. okay, so you think for a minute. See, see yeah, they did respond that they didn't know of the archer. Yeah, they they yeah. just uh, said that they didn't know Senric. Well, this one did over here. Um, you old, you were. Did you actually ask somebody to, if you know, ask around you, kind of maybe in a whispered uh, uh, sentence, saying, uh, "What do you think? Is he lying?" I, I know they look like she's in the picture, but uh, that's just the general character. No, yeah, I, I definitely asked. Like, quietly. Okay, so you, you guys hear Yuald ask that. Luthwin, you can barely hear that. I'm going to come back to how that uh, uh, no, no sound escapes your notice here in a minute. Anyone? No. No one wants to bet me up, so I'm just going to go down the street. No, 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 no. Hang on, hang on. We're not there yet. Let me go around the table. Come on, man. Oh. Uh, you know, this is what it is. We're signed up from 6.30 to 9.30 Central Standard Time, which is 7.30 to 10.30 your time. Okay. Yeah, and it's 15 after. Yeah, and I'm trying to get there. Okay, so, uh, Luthwin? You cannot hear absolutely everything. It says no sound escapes your notice. Uh, I'm going to amend that and say unless it's drowned out by the rush of water. The Anduin is a, a, you know, I don't know if you've ever heard rushing water before, but it drowns out everything. I have, and yeah, I can drown out a lot of it. Mm-hmm. But... So, you might have heard, uh, we do not know Senric. So, anything you want to do? Can I roll insight? Um, if you get closer, yeah. You could probably step right, right next to Duota or right past her. The, the, the tokens are not necessarily going to fill that full space. Okay. okay. So, go ahead and roll insight. Uh -huh. Oh, wow. It actually listed the short rest and the prolonged rest. That's cool. Okay. Uh, nope. So, okay, you don't want to spend anything on it? No. No, you're not even close. So, yeah, that's not going to help. Um, all right. Uh, Norin, you asked your question, do you want to try and roll insight? Or do you just want to rush in where... Mm -hmm. Where angels fear to tread. I, just don't uh, I have one of the insight, but I guess since no one else is trying to do it, okay. I don't, see, I no, I don't even have the skill. Well, I, well, I mean, I don't have any skill. Yeah, you don't have any ranks in it, but you can still try um, with, using just the feet um, die. I want to go ahead and use a cold point. To okay. Turn in my arms. Okay. Oh, okay, that's nice. You can tell most assuredly that uh, uh, this individual here is not entirely convinced of his own lie. That's what I figured. All right, so whoever you are, you are lying. He needs to surrender the item he stole or your lives to forfeit. Okay, um... Uh, oh, oh, what am I doing here? Um, you know what? I need to come back to you in just a minute. Radigan, what do you want to do? You wanted to look over in in here? Um, uh -oh. do I want to, hmm? You wanted to look over in here, right? Uh, yeah, you said it was livestock, a livestock pen, right? Yeah, that's, that's all that there is to it. There's nothing special. Um, it was being used last night for a different purpose. That's why there was a fire in there. Really? Mm hmm Can I discern the purpose by no. studying it? No. Not unless you get into the, into the pen with the pigs. <laughs> get down and dirty. Yep. 
I'm also looking around to see if I can spot any more than the four that I saw last night around the fire. Um, let, let me see something here. Um, I need to scroll out a little bit and see. No, you do not. I'm not even going to give you a roll on it because there's mm -hmm. no way you would. <laughs> okay, so uh, I'm going to come back to Noreen real quick. Uh, and see about, um, go ahead, let's see, it's not going to be that, what do you think would be best for the type of intimidation you're trying to do? It's probably not courtesy. Well, courtesy can be used for intimidation, but... Um, you're, you're, I think you're more trying to persuade, um, which doesn't yeah, seem very good. Yeah, I don't have any reason that anyway. Well, <laughs> I mean, you can still roll the, the feet die yeah. for it. Yeah. And if you roll yeah. a Gandalf's rune, it's kind of an automatic thing. Yeah. So, true. I mean, you raise your voice. You're a liar. Yeah. Uh, we want the sickle back. Well, I didn't say sickle. I said the item he stole. Okay. I was trying not to give him away. Okay. The other ones are dumb, but hmm. I just don't know. Um, but I was also trying to get him to either deny it or, or you know, okay. giving him the chance to, to hmm. respond one way or the other before he went further down the steps. Okay, so you, you step down the steps a little bit. Uh, do the rest of you kind of follow him? Yes. Okay. I'm backing him up as best I can. Okay. We, we came here from the circle, so. What you all now see is that th there are shifty eyes going on between uh, all four of these individuals down here. Uh, mm -hmm. And, and uh, Duardo, you can now see this one also. Um, right. So it's not like Top Gun where they keep splitting off. There's just four of them. Um, so anyway, you step forward and they kind of start looking at one another. And they actually start to back off a little bit. And I need to... Oh, yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. Stop. Okay. But they're not backing off too far. Well, um, I mean, they're not surrendering him either, so... That's true. That's very true. So I'm, I'm, I'm just going to lift up my night and say, You don't want to die, boy. Turn, <sighs> turn the item over. This isn't a way to go. Well, um... You okay? There's, all of, they're all humans, right? They're all men. Um. The, yes, they're all. Uh, there are three men, one woman. Okay, yeah, I believe it's yeah. Um, this one down here is female. The other three are males. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm a young boy, but I'm gonna outlive them all. Mm -hmm. so, Could all of <laughs> all four of you give me an insight check, please? Sure. Sure. <laughs> This could go really badly. No, not necessarily. That's okay. not what I'm trying to check for. Okay. Hey, I good? succeeded. Hey, everybody succeeded except Radigant. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. Don't pick up on Shulsa's cues too much because you're silent. Yeah, exactly. Okay, who did that? Me. Dora? No, wait a minute. I thought you yes. already rolled. You rolled, Norin, no, Luthman. Oh, okay. No, you didn't. Okay, so yeah, you got a great success. One thing all of you except Radigand notice is the four of these, ha the weapons are in disrepair. The clothing they're wearing is patchwork at best, and mm -hmm. all four of them are thin. Now, out of the female, for the female, you that's not really that big of a deal. But for the males, you can tell they are on the verge of being gaunt. Okay. 
and uh, Norin, you might take satisfaction in understanding that they are fearful, or at least the one that you was speaking is fearful. In fact, this one uh, yells back, Senric, what did you take now? <laughs> and I, and, you know, I'm going to step a little further down and say, Turn it over, mm -hmm. Cedric. Or Cedric. And you and your friends can keep your lives. I'm and afraid it's friend. not that easy. He steps forward. And, and why is that? It, it, because we've been paid to do a job, we must eat. Well, food can be given in exchange. What are you going to give it? Can you feed a whole village? I have plenty of coin that I can give that will feed your village. Okay, um... Give it a simple, and it's yours. Okay. And I, have, and I offer a uh, couch and hold, or, you know, coins for my... No, no. Okay, so are you actually going to put down your, your axe in order to get to it? No, no. I, I can hold it with one hand temporarily while I fish out the, the, the bag and shake it at you know, the pouch and shake okay. it for impotence and then stick it back in my pouch. Okay. Pouch and say, exchange the sickle and it's yours. Give me a courtesy plus one dice. This one. Uh oh. Two more as well. It, yeah. Does Does anyone want to try and support? I mean, he, yes, uh, yes. Oh, yeah. definitely. On. I will. Hold um, on. Hold there's on. no reason for. <laughs> hold there's on. There's no reason for everyone to starve, which should definitely help. That That's true. Um, do any of you have Norin as a fellowship focus? Um, I do. Okay. So, do you want to throw a hope point and allow him to roll an additional d6? Yes. Okay. So, actually, I'm sorry, uh, that would be an additional 2d6 because you would be inspired. Mm -hmm. So, go ahead and, and uh, Ross, go ahead and roll uh, 2d6. Yeah. Okay, let me see how that broke down. Okay, ooh, okay, so you've got a Tangwar rune, yeah. and you've got, uh, okay, he, this is going to get interesting. Um... Okay, so Senric takes the sickle out from behind his back and he throws it right about here. Okay? Well, oh, one of my friends. Hmm. But. Hmm. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, so, what treachery is this? You couldn't just exchange it? I am exchanging it for food. No, yeah. And at about that time, no, he doesn't throw it at you. He throws it on the ground. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and at about that time, you hear a very strong voice. Senric, what are you doing? <sighs> and three people. I my magic. <laughs> come up about there. Uh, they just finished getting out of a boat. Um, some of you are not, still not going to be able to see, let me see, what have we got here? Line of sight here. No, I mean, yeah, I mean, I yep. people. You can see a really big dude right here, Norin. And, uh, uh, yep. there is a lady yeah. walking right next to him. Uh, yeah. I gotta scroll out just a little bit. And he's smashing some hands. <laughs> Okay, uh, Radigan, you do not, but you see the lady? Duota, yes, you can see both of them. You old? Uh, you can see all three. And then Duota, you can only, yeah, you can only see the two, really. Let me see something here. Yeah. Coming down the steps. 
Mm -hmm. And read my mind and say, that was the wrong choice you made. Uh, uh, Senric thinks you're talking to him. And he's like caught up behind, so he starts backing off. Oh, let me get the right one. He starts kind of backing off. Oh. And he's looking back and forth between Noreen and Guthrid. Do I recognize this fellow? You do not. You've never seen him before. Um, Does he look like... Like a or a or something? Uh, let, uh, actually, let me see. Uh, I've forgotten. This is not see. Dunedain or something. Oh, um, you could easily mistake Guthrid for a woodman. Okay. But he's got better weapons and better clothing. Yeah. Um, okay. you know what? Give me... Hold on. That's fine. Let me see here. Let me open your character if I can. Yeah. Okay. Um, that's not really going to help you. Uh, give me a basic lore check. I mean, I'm just trying to determine whether he's evil or just really. Yes. Or. Oh, uh, okay. Now, you, you, unless you want to throw something at that, and I, I don't think you do, but... Yeah. Um, he, he, like I said, he appears to be a woodman, and the the two that are flanking him appear to be woodmen as well, um, even though you only see the one on his left. Um, they are uh, better dressed and, and better armed. Yeah. yeah. That's fine. Okay. Um, now I gotta, I've gotta find out what everybody wants to do. We're gonna start at the bottom. Radigand? Dang it. Um, I'm back in Norn up, so whatever he wants to do. Okay. Luthwin? Uh, no, I'm back in it, uh, back in uh, up as well. Okay. You old? Uh, yeah. Just, just a little bit. What's that? I'm sorry, I got a little lost for a moment. What's going on? Are you? Uh, you went to sleep, is what you did. Um, that's okay. I understand. Uh, <laughs> a, a busy day will get there. Um, okay. Uh, do you want to back Noreen up in the fight against Guthrid, or are you just gonna? Are you gonna try and do something different? I'm gonna back him up. Just try to be non-lethal if I can. Okay. Um. All right. Fair enough. And then Duota. Uh. Well, I'm going to try and grab the sickle. Okay. All right. Fair. Fair enough. We'll get to that in a minute. Um. So here's what we're gonna do. Do we want to do this combat tonight, or cut it and and finish next week? Let's finish next week. It sounds like uh. Ross is tired. Yeah. I'm not, I'm not tired. I just wanted to move things along. Well, <laughs> I, actually, I think this will move things along nicely if we want to spend a few more minutes working on this. Later. I mean, I offered them, I offered them a way out without, you know, them dying or getting in here. What, so. Okay, what do you say? I said I made a deal and offered him no. coin. What? Oh, you're oh you're talking about Senric. Yeah. Okay. So you offered him a deal and and uh, and what else? I told him if he returned that item or exchanged the item he stole, which is the circle of the moon, I would give him coin. That will finally feed him in his village. Okay. Well, he comes and he says, I am Guthrid the Viglunding, and I paid Senric to get the sickle. You may not have it. Well, then, 
you are going to lose your life if you don't turn it back over. It's not yours to have. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I see where you're coming from, but no, that's not going to work. So are we definitely going to get into a fight then? Yep. Because <laughs> he's not going to uh, negotiate and uh, take the coin out of it. And okay. He, he paid them to steal it. So. In that case, Guthrid comes forward a bit after signaling for these two back here to wait. He looks at Cynric and he says, I'll deal with you in a minute. And, um, oh, yep. what happened there? Yeah. And, uh, so, come on, would you point in the right direction? Um, and then he looks at you and he says, just you and me. <coughs> and he Let's beats see. on his chest and mm. says, mm. come mm. get it, dwarf. <laughs> I, um, I start relating my uh, my lineage the way he's going. Go ahead. <laughs> uh, now you <yeah>, my sheep. <laughs> I am Lord of Erebor, hero of the Battle of Five Armies. Oh, I was at that battle. I, I served. No, you weren't. Not a Dundling doesn't was not there. There were so many. And you I could not know. Dane Ironfoot. Yeah. You were there on the wrong side then. Thief. Oh. And he he's like ready to charge. Okay, go ahead and pick your, your stance. Don't forget to right click. Yeah. Yeah. Um. All right. Oh, it's not letting me pick. Yeah. That? That's weird. It doesn't like having a shooter either. Yeah, it's not huh? bringing the stands up. You have a. Oh, I haven't. Combat? Yeah, I haven't begun combat yet. You're not firing yet, so let me open volley, begin combat. Okay, now pick your stance. <laughs> so should we not get closer so that uh, Norrin can't be flanked by the others? Um, you know, you can if you want, and if it comes down to adding you guys to the combat, we'll do that. Duota, um, I'm not even going to make you make an athletics check. Okay, so uh, you can you can get down the steps and grab the uh, the sickle, pretty much right there. Um, and Norrin is standing in front of it, probably on purpose. You guys can go ahead and move your, your tokens, but Norrin, um... He, it won't set me right. What is okay, you want what? I want, def okay, I want defensive, I think I got it. Uh, yeah, yeah, you're in defensive. Oh, You've been in defensive. My, yeah, it disconnected me, that's why. Um, okay, it yeah. Weird. It looks like a few oh, people I got disconnected. I'm going to refresh. Wait a minute. I think that's a sign. I need to get to bed. Well, um, you don't have to be involved in the combat, and we can kind of update you again uh, next week before we, we start the new Torg adventure. Fair enough? All right, but if you need my axe, it's, um, I'm swinging with Norrin. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Have a good night. All Let's right. Go. Yeah, take it easy, and we'll finish this up as quick as we can for the rest of you. Okay, so... No right. sweet, sweet dreams, everybody. And to you. Thank you for being here. Good night. All right. Uh, so, Norrin, uh, in second edition, um, unless you guys are overwhelmed and you're not, if this is a one-on-one -on -one competition, PCs go first. Yeah, well, I'm just waiting on him. He's the one that wanted to charge me. So, uh oh no, he's angry, but he's not charging. He's well, not I'm, stupid. <laughs> well, I, just, I, just, I just pick up the sickle then. While I'm here, and he does and move then, forward a little bit. I already picked up the sickle. I pick up the sickle and then ready my, you know, 
put it in my belt and ready my magic. Well, hold on. Uh, Duota said that she was coming down to grab the sickle. So, oh, okay. Well, yeah. I'll let her take it then. Yeah. I'll um, just hold my magic and say, come on. So you want you're you're gonna let him swing first? Yeah, I'm defensive stance. Okay. So let me go ahead. Uh he gets Ooh. Yeah, he's got a two handed great axe. Uh that he two handed mate, so Yeah, there you go. Oh, <laughs> I need to choose. I need to target first. Come on, Paul. Pull your head out of your fourth point of contact. Uh let's see. He is oh, he is favored in that. Okay, so target number is 16. All right, let's see what's going on. And he missed. Uh, let's yep. see, what kind of hate does he have? He's got five hate. Um, let me see, he's got hideous toughness. Okay, he hasn't done any damage, but no quarter. Okay, so he doesn't have anything that I can really do with him right now. Uh, with his hate. So, it's Norian's did turn. You remember the, did you remember the subtract a die when you rolled two? But why Why did I subtract a die again? I'm in defensive stance. Uh, yeah, that that automatically took place. Oh, so, yes. he's okay. got... Okay, okay, yeah, see, if you look at the formula, um, he's got a, 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 a great axe of three. So that was automatically oh, okay. success. Yeah, but he's favored. Okay, cool. So. Yeah, yeah. All right. That was just checking. All right. Uh, so my turn. Yeah, you've got to double right click on him. Oh, yeah. Yep. Uh, Here we go. Okay. Uh, I'm going to spend the point of hope. Oh, okay. Going to end it mm -hmm. quick, huh? Yep. Ooh. Roll of third and that's with a point of hope? It's because his defense is so high. What the hell? Oh yeah, that's right. Don't team. don't forget you lose uh one dice in defensive stance when you oh, try to hit yeah. as well. Yeah, yeah, that one that's what hurt me. So okay, so yep. you spent a point of hope. Um yeah, yeah, some track in it. Yeah. So, okay. But uh, that gave you your bonus as well, right? Because that's 6, 10, 13. No, that, that just gave you your roll. It should have given you an extra dice. That should have given you an extra dice and then an extra dice. Do you have uh, two ranks? Or three? Yeah, I have two. Oh, okay. All right. So, yeah, you, you both of you missed the first time around. Okay, yep. um, and let me go ahead and cycle through here. Do, do. Okay, do you want to strike first this time? Um, yeah, uh, yeah, so I hit. Do you want to change your feet. stance? Yeah, I want to change it to four. There you go. So you go first. Um, let's spend another point of hope. Then. Okay. I cannot see your fa the faces on your dice. They're all black to me. Okay, so you do seven damage to him, and it did not take it away, so I've got to do that. So, okay, got that. Okay. And then it's his turn to come back with the great axe. If he strikes you, I will be spending a point of hate to use his hideous toughness. So uh, I'd like to use some of the fellowship and get some of the if that's okay with everybody that's here, I'm good with it too. Guys? All right. Uh, yeah, all right. Okay, let me get over here to the brook and uh, turn that on. And okay, come on. What the heck? Okay, I got to close that. And then I've got to close that. It's not letting me grab. Why? Oh, it's because I'm on the wrong damn tab. And I'm still on the wrong damn tab. Okay, there we go. So, Control-C, let me copy that, bring it over to the Fall Rock. 
Okay, and oh, uh, do 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 do, and Control V. There we go. Okay, so uh, everybody's okay with you using a point of fellowship. So that'll bring that down to nine. Why is that not? Okay, there we go. Text and. Okay, so you just refilled your your hope. Yeah, the one I spent. Yeah. Okay. So I'm at eight. Okay. So I'm Guthrid. Sure, I'm, yeah. I'll I'll worry about using more if I need it. So. Okay. All right. So, oh, I thought I selected a target. I had you selected as a target. Oh, I think when I switched maps, it dropped my targeting. Okay, so. Let's go ahead and roll that. Okay. Still a failure. Holy smokes. You're getting super lucky. Okay. Yeah. So that's that round. So you guys are, are watching the swinging of the axes. Uh, like a tennis match, your heads are going back and forth. Um, so. My, my turn? Yep. It's your turn. Okay, great success. Okay, so that gets you, uh, let's see. Oh, heavy blow here, here we go. Now, do you want to do a heavy blow or a piercing? Oh, you chose the piercing or the heavy blow. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, it, doesn't, it didn't line up um, piercing. But... Okay, well, that's 13 damage right there. Um, okay. So it's 20 so far. Yep, so... He stumbles back, and he looks at the gash that's kind of across his chest and, and the little bit of blood that's welling there, and he exhales greatly. <clears throat> okay, now, uh, let's see. Uh, let's do this. And this. Okay, and I got to do a GM roll to see something. Okay. There we go, and roll that. Oh, nope, he stays. He gets back up, and he growls mightily and charges back at you. Okay, so he charges forward, and it's his turn, right? So yep. let's get this going. Okay, and... Ooh, ooh, no. No, no, no. Um, how defeated do you want to get? Oh, I didn't mean to make that a private GM. Did that one come up as a private GM role? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Hold, hold on, hold on, hold on. Reveal to everyone. Okay, that's what he no, got. It doesn't, doesn't defeat me. It doesn't defeat you, but what did he roll? He's got... He's got can't see my armor to even wound me. Okay, he rolled two Tangwar runes, one for each of his favored dice, so he cannot, since that's basically a zero for him, uh, the only thing that he can do is heavy blows. So, that's 19 damage to Norin. Yeah, I'm still alive. Okay. I mean, I did 20 to him, so... Yeah. It's a fair thing. Okay. But you ready to swing at him one more time? Oh, yeah. Oh, I forgot to use the hideous toughness. Oh. Not that I was trying to kill your character, just, you know, I could. Uh, let's see. Great success. I kill your character, I swear. <laughs> okay, so you rolled a Gandalf's rune. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12... Plus a Gandalf. Okay, so I need to make a protection test. Thir okay, well, 13 damage is... is, is uh... Okay. Guthrid is protected. He doesn't take a wound, but since he took 11 points past his uh, endurance, you yeah, knock him... Yeah. yeah, you knock him yeah. completely down. He is, he is not dead. He's incapacitated. Okay, mm -hmm. so let's see. Where's an incapacitated? How do I incapacitate? Mm -hmm. That's wary. Stunned. Oh, he should have been marked wary for yep. one thing. 
So that would have knocked out his roll. Oh, there you go. What is that? That's unconscious. There you go. I wouldn't probably have taken so much damage, though. That's all right. Whatever. There we go. He is unconscious. Yeah, but you get the sickle. Yep. Okay, Duardo's already got that, Radigan. Um, you complete your deal with Senric. And these two... Oh, yeah, those two down there... They're not, they're not getting any coin, though. They're, they're not... They're, huh? I had to fight this, this asshole. Well, yeah, but that wasn't that was, Senric's that deal. Was, that, yeah, he... He had paid my down. Yeah. I'm not, giving, I'm not giving him my gold. This oh, no. A, not your gold. Your food. Oh, I mean, I, they have some rations, sure. Okay. All right. You give some rations. And then yeah. um, all six, well, four, five, six, all seven um, are like, may we have safe passage? Um, and we will go. And trouble you no yeah. more. No. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, let's see. I don't. Let's see. I. I don't think I can do this in a. I have to do it one at a time. So, okay. These ones take off. They are all in a big line. Um, they put their swords away and and just go. They are out. Okay. Um, I assume there's some room for something around here. Um, yeah, you could find some rope. Sure. Tying this guy up and take mm -hmm. him back from trial. Okay. Yeah, you tie him up. And who's going to carry him? He's pretty heavy. Oh, he can walk when he's conscious. Okay. So you I'm wait a little while for that? Yeah, I'm going to disarm him and stuff and rest my soul. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, so, uh, let mm -hmm. me get over here. Go back for mass reading this stuff. Then. Okay, so, so I'm sure would like to have a talk with him. Mm -hmm. All right, so it takes you guys about a week. Okay, who who all is that? Uh, I'm gonna have to figure that out. It takes you about a week, uh, about the same amount of time it took to get there to mm -hmm. get back to Stony Fort. Okay. Yeah, oh, that's fine. And uh, let's see. Uh, hold on. I've got I Nori. I have, I have people capable of hunting and, you know, good so, for me, so. Yeah. So, old boy uh, tries to give you some problems, oh, um, but it's obvious he, he's not able to give you too many problems. He is a big lunding, so he is actually wanted by the Bayornings at the old Ford. So, if you wanted to, you could turn him over there. I will, because that will save me from having to deal with hauling him all the way back to the village. Okay, does everybody agree with that? I'll take payment for his one. I would one like. And share it with my companions. Okay, uh, all right, fair enough. Duardo, what was that? I would like some manner of written confirmation that we were the guys that turned that guy in so that I could show it back to the uh, council and say, you know, hey, we turned this guy into so-and-so. That's why we didn't bring the culprit back here for our trial. Okay. All right. That yeah, sounds fair fine. enough. Yep. Um, no, so we're having a simple too, so. Yeah. Okay. So each of you gets two points of treasure from turning him in each of you because he was worth 10 treasure and since since the others haven't been here no big deal um now duota um you are hailed in the village when you return you were the one who won the sickle um uh, but when you return, Torvald is there, and he says, Now, the sickle is to be delivered back to our master, Beorn, for the winter, but in the spring, he will deliver it to your family himself. That would be an immense honor. Thank you. 
and and they're they're very happy with you they hail you as the big winner and everything like that um uh and there's drinks all around and food all around and you guys are welcome to stay uh for a little while and we're we're not going to make a decision tonight on staying or anything like that for um for all of you um you get three treasure on top of the the treasure that you've already earned Mm -hmm. and then um for duota your family uh gives you personally three more treasure oh wow so you guys have earned like duota you will have earned like eight nine gold nine gold pieces this time and then Wait, the rest how much of, treasure do we get more? Um, okay, you get three uh, so from just coming have... back. Each of your families pays you three gold or three treasure to to have participated. All of you participated. All of you gain some treasure. Okay? So, yeah, so it should have six. Yeah. Other than Yoda has like eight or whatever. Yes. Yes, exactly. Now, we're 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 gonna kind of put these characters in stasis uh, after I find out what all of you want to do. We're only a half uh, an hour late. Well, if we're staying here, does our hope reset? Um, you know what? Let's make that decision later. That's fine. Okay, so you know, I, uh, I'd rather play my own character oh. if I play. Wait a minute. Yeah, there's there's nine hope uh, from the fellowship rating remaining. We can take care of that. Okay. So yeah. who? Okay. I'm I'm gonna go down the list. I'm sorry. Uh, du- I spent a lot. <laughs> yeah, I know you spent a lot. Uh, let me go down the list. Duota, how much did you spend? Um. In the I way think of hope. Our, fa- our our hope refreshed. Uh, before this adventure today, right? Uh, well, it it refreshes at the end of the game session. Ah. So how how much uh how much hope uh did you spend? I believe before. No, I No, look at your character two. sheet. <laughs> look at your I character sheet. I already refreshed it manually. Oh. Um. Okay, you, you you gotta wait on me for that because I'm kind of I'm trying to do a lot of things at the same time. You refreshed it manually, um, and then um, Norin. Okay, so okay, uh, Radigand. I've got to look at her. I, I'm doing this one at a time because I I can only do so much. She spent three. You old. Remy? Yes, sir. I okay, uh how much uh hope did you spend? I just spent one. One? Okay. Luthwin? Uh what? How much okay. hope did you spend? <laughs> sorry, sorry. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I uh two. Two and then Norin. I spent eight, but so I spent last game too. Well, I'm I'm I we're get, I didn't get it all back. Yeah, we're we're kind How of. How much do you have left? <clears throat> yeah, I have, I have I have eight from my total. Okay. Oh, you have eight remaining. No, I'm eight. I spent eight. Okay. That's what I thought you said. Yep. That's what I thought you said. So. <laughs> Oh no. That's gonna um, okay, so that's, okay. So everybody would get one back and then there's four left. So Okay. Two, three so that's yeah, that's nine right there. Okay, so as it stands right now, Duota, uh you get yours back. Radigand will get two back, so let me increase that back to ten. Okay. Um, okay. You old, you get one back. 
and that should take care of you. Luthwin, you get your two back, and then Norin, you get two. Now, hold on, because when we come back, uh, or if we come back, if you guys want to do the fellowship phase, we'll we'll do the fellowship phase also. But we'll have to figure that out, and you guys might be able to to do pretty well in that. But um, for uh, for Norin. Let's see, that would... Okay, you get three more back because of recovery after combat. Okay, because mm -hmm. you're supposed to get uh, half of the hope that you spent and half of the mm -hmm. endurance that you spent back mm -hmm. from combat. Yeah, well, I mean, we still have wing hitting back, so my endurance is probably fine, though. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Cool. So to kind of close things down, um, we'll, we'll kind of do a Q&A session next week about what you what you all think about the game, uh, what we experienced here. I did a crappy job. I know that. But uh, it's sure. kind of my first time with second edition, and there's yeah. some big changes. Okay. Yeah. Um, okay. But uh, Catherine, uh, we'll get together yes. tomorrow to uh, hopefully finish up your Torg character. It shouldn't be too hard. And then Ross, um, let you and me at some point, since we talk all the time anyway, um, <laughs> uh, we'll set a time to to knock out your Torg character. Fair enough? Yeah, that's fine. Now, Remy. Yes, sir. Are you interested at all? Because I'm, I'm, I'm just going to tell you right now, it, it, I don't mind running with seven characters, but... Um, so, you know, if you would like to play, let me know. Oh, well, I'll, I'll work on thinking about it, I promise. Okay, you think about it, and then you and me need to figure out how we're going to get our tabletop face-to-face -to -face group together, uh, with, you know, with building my character, okay? <sighs> okay. We can get it figured out. I get off at five just about every day, so. Okay. All right. Well, actually, that might be quite easy to do then. We'll, we'll figure it out. We'll get her done. So yeah, we got time. anything you guys want to want to say before we, we jet for the night? Um, thanks for running, and it was fun playing with everybody. Sorry, I got a little testy. Um, I was just impatient. Well, and, all right. It happens to everyone. It, it yeah. happens to me all the time, so... <laughs> Yeah, I, I just really, I'm a massive token fan, so I just wanted to, you know, hurry along. <laughs> yeah. But, uh, yeah, hope to play with y'all again, get to know y'all better, and uh, have a good one. All right. Uh, what about any of the rest of you? This was a lot of fun, and I wouldn't mind coming back to the One Ring, you know, if we ever have another need for another interim game. This was a lot of fun, and I really enjoyed playing with you guys. Excellent. I, I appreciate that a great deal. Okay. All right. Um, and I suppose, what about you, Connor? What do you think? I had fun. Good. Good. I'm glad to hear it. I I know I was getting testy as well, um, and it, because I'm trying to learn all of this, and there are things that don't work in the in the second edition game system on Foundry that uh, that I probably misinterpreted in the book. So <laughs> so okay. So let's get together next time uh, when we can have Ginger there with us, and hopefully Andrew, and uh, and, and we'll see about it. Okay. Okay. All Good right, my friends. Good night. Good night. Good evening. Good evening. Take it easy. I'll see you at one tomorrow, cat.